And I think that's cool. Just perfect. Perfect enough um, for stuffing chicken wings. Um, I'm also going to be serving butter beans with ham hocks. Well, with ham shanks in it. For all those who like butter beans. And we're going to begin down with some yummy eats. We also have some good cabbage going on. And in our oven, got delicious cornbread coming out. So let's get started. We're gonna pull our cornbread. It's ready. Oh, that smells so good. And it, and it, and it was buttermilk cornbread. I made buttermilk cornbread uh, to go go with the um with. With the butter beans. What more is more good than butter beans and cornbread? Let's pull it out of the oven. Thank you. Can I get a knife? And inside our cornbread, we have onions that, that were placed inside. You can look right there in the texture and see the onion. Um, inside our cornbread. And it looks like it needs to cook a little longer, so we'll put it back in, let it keep on cooking. That's why I wanted to taste that. Should use a toothpick. And over here in this section, we have my son. Turn my oven back on. Let that keep going for a little while. Because we got a, a lot of good time going. Right now, we're stuffing our chicken wings over here in this section right here. So we got time for the cornbread to get done. We're stuffing our chicken wings with um, broccoli and cheese. Gonna be putting broccoli inside. The chicken. While my um while my cornbread cooks. And everybody loves uh Creamy macaroni and cheese. Uh, especially when it goes inside fried chicken wings with delicious broccoli. So it's getting all over my hands, that's okay. All right, got some squeezing out. So we got one stuff. And you can see inside with the broccoli and cheese inside. Great cool mixture for stuffing fried chicken wings. Let's do another one. I, know I, I, I wish I had somebody that knew how to work the camera so y'all can really get what's going on. Sorry, I got my, my 12 year old son. He's here on the camera. So y'all bear with me. Y'all can't really get all the effects and see everything. It's broccoli and cheese. Macaroni and It's broccoli and macaroni and cheese being stuffed inside chicken wings. And I'm about to fry it. And that's the first time raw chicken ever looked good. What's up, DDG? You'll be up here, DD. You coming? We're gonna put the broccoli inside the chicken. I'm gonna move this back over here. I'm just moving the. I had to move the pan for the camera. 
So y'all can see. Let's stuff this one. Let's add some more macaroni inside my chicken wing. And my hands full of cheese. I should just wipe it off before I do it, but y'all just gotta watch. Y'all hands gonna be like this too if you try it. All right. There. Oh. And we got another one stuff. And you go to the food, you're too close. Hey. You're too close. Too close. I got it. Okay, so I'm back. I just had to wash my hands. And that's how you stuff, I'm sorry. You know, the kids think getting really close is like the effect, and it's not. Y'all can't really see it like that. Okay. So, for all booking and all catering, contact me at 860-2452. We got our solid gold live. So, Rick, you go ahead and fry the whole wings. And I'll come back and I'll fry the macro, um, the, the, the stuff fried chicken wings with macaroni and cheese. All right. Yeah, because the grease, I already had the grease hot. You hear it popping. Just waiting on the chicken to go inside. You can get a plate, Amber. You can get one. I'm in here now. I got to do some uh, catering and some prepping, but I actually wanted to create some new dishes. So I'm going to drop the macaroni and cheese with broccoli for the kids. But you're so welcome to come and get a plate. Big shout out, Tennessee. Thanks, DD. Thanks, Tennessee. How many people like butter beans and cornbread? What about butter beans and buttermilk cornbread? You welcome, Amber. Thank you. Thanks for shopping with me. You always come through and shop. Thank you. I appreciate you. I love butter beans and especially green lima beans. They're my favorite. You love them too? Me too. I can't wait till the cornbread get done. If you want to stuff the chicken wings and I can drop them first, we can do whatever. Whatever you want to do. I wish I had four hands, y'all. I'll be getting down in here. I'm ready to drop some chicken wings. I got my macaroni already. Oh, I can start fixing plates. I just need for this cornbread to go on ahead and do what it need to do. See some bubbles. Oh, I don't even have the light on. Yes, sir. Uh oh, there we go. Thanks, Didi. I need to start about this. What page am I? My, my, my Tasty So Yummy page? Yeah, bro. What's up, Tasty So Yummy? I actually was working and I had my son load up the live for me. So I can give us some soul food and some good home cooking. Everybody likes good home cooking every now and then. It's nothing wrong with lobster. I love lobster, but every now and then, we got to put something in our bodies. Something in our bodies that's real, real good. Something that we was raised off of, like buttermilk cornbread. Buttermilk cornbread and cabbage. Good old cabbage.
One second. Can you give me a hand? I mean, it's on there. Like for over. Um, could you put a pin through the um a pin? I'm ready to drop the chicken wings. Just could you put st stick a pin through those and let me drop those live on film right fast. Well, I'm just gonna go ahead and start cooking it. Huh? I got an assistant with me. I just need to pin the uh, chicken wings up and drop them. No, sir, I'll do them. I just need them pinned down so I can batter them up and fry them. How many people out there like cabbage? Cabbage or cornbread? Cabbage or collard greens? Which, which one? Which one? Which one you like the best? And now we have our, our chicken wings that's getting uh, closed up. I'm gonna add a little seasoning. Could you pull the top off this? Oh, I got brand new seasoning. You'll pull the top off this for me. Or grab me that or pass me that seasoning. Thank you. Could you open this up? Thank you, sir. And I'm going to be adding some Old Bay um, to this. Because I want the macaroni and cheese to have a Creole type of taste. And I'm looking for one more seasoning. You see my Cajun seasoning up in there? I got it. I'm going to accent. Yeah. That seasoning right there. That's one side. I know I got flour on this side. That's fine. It's still the same. That's fine. Cause one side got a lot of little seasoning on it. I'm fine with that. Let's go back down. And it's in my flour, so I'm good with that. Take that off and put the hot oil back on, please. Slide over. Thank you. And now we should be getting ready. I'll just let my oil get a little bit hot. Um, I need some red peppers, bell peppers cut for the for the potato salad. That's all I had to add. Is that nice still there? Red bell peppers. Now let's check it out. I need the butter. And it should have been heated up in the skillet and poured over the hot cornbread. Grab a small skillet for me real fast. I'm trying to teach my son how to cook, y'all, while I'm doing this with y'all. Some really cool things. Just put it on the stove. I need it now. Put it on the hot one. Right. There you go. What on the shelf like? Yeah, we just need some hot bowl. Oh, put it in there. Put it in there. That's all you have to do. Thank you. What's up, Sincerely? I'm trying to get it done. You don't have to do all this. It's going to go back in here. Listen, follow the chef. You're learning from a chef. It's not that difficult. Follow, follow your father. Listen, just listen to me. You're making things way harder than they are. 
I'm going to get, see how this melt right here? It don't need the plastic paper off because what you're going to do is take it, wrap this back up and put it back in the refrigerator. So a lot of stuff you just need to just listen. Hey man, follow direct specific orders. You don't need to do all that too much. Now take this out, wrap that back up. See how I'm holding it? As you can grab it just like that. This is shelf school, learning, one-on-one. That's all you had to do. You're gonna take this hot butter now. Y'all follow me? You're gonna pour it over the cornbread. Right, now just fold it up and put it in. Don't even take no time, don't even think about it. Once you start thinking about it, start it long, start it wrong. Now you have cornbread. You're gonna turn that on 500 degrees broil. We're gonna brown the top of this cornbread with the butter. Yeah, not, most of the time people start studying and doing things too wrong in the kitchen. That's why they full turn out like it's turning out. It's taking it way too far. You'll help me with this. That looks really, really good. Gonna put that right there. Do we have the red pep, red peppers uh, for the for the um we just need a few for our uh, servings for the, the potato salad. Dice, small. Thanks, Cecily. Uh, Terrence, thanks, Terrence. It's really a hard job um, just maintaining the kitchen and cooking and stuff like that. Put that over there. I got some chicken wings that's going. I'm the only chef around, the only cook in here. I'm trying to teach my son how to catch up. Yeah, you gotta try some of these, Dee Dee. That's why I'm showing you. Cause Dee Dee coming from Tennessee, she's gonna be checking out the town. And um, she's gonna be up here for a week. Thanks, Tennessee, for coming through. Big shout out, Huntsville. Now we have stuffed chicken wings with broccoli and macaroni and cheese. And we gonna fry them. Tasty, eat so yummy. There we go, fast. Smaller. They need to be smaller. They need to be bite sized so we can eat them. They're not gonna cook down. So we got our chicken wings frying. I need a whisk, please. I'm gonna need the basket. Thanks, Didi. I can't wait for you to come through here. I'm gonna have a lot of fun. Y'all check Didi out too. She's a poet. Got some great poetry. I'm gonna wipe my screen. Hold on, I might need to wipe this off again for y'all. There's a lot of grease coming in here. And what I like to do when I have a batter like that, that's way too big. Those are, could you cut those smaller bite size for the for the for folks so we can bite them? That's way. That's like going into like I don't know. And I'm gonna reap out of these. I like to get that initial fry on mine, and then I'm gonna come down with a buttermilk batter. Bam. That's just me though. That's like I said, bite size so we can bite them in your mouth. All right, so I'm coming with a buttermilk batter now. Back on my chicken wings. Oh yeah. Cause I want them extra crispy. Now, now I'm gonna drop them. This is a Creole buttermilk uh, style batter. Yeah, it's just, it's just like, two, we're only doing two servings, so you only had to dice up like eight dice. 
could have took five seconds. That's really too big, but that'll be fine. Right, you have in our potato salad that I made. That's gonna go on our plate. In, in, inside the little containers that's our side, just put some potato salad in the sides and then, no. Rick, if you turn around, put some potato salad in the side and then place them on in there so we can see them. While I fry the chicken, that's all you have to do. Can you give me a shirt for this? For this. Now we're gonna check them out. Watch these, DD. You know I'm raising a little boy too. All you have to do is dice up some red peppers and bell peppers and put them inside the potato salad. Did you grab it? I got the camera, mom. I'm still here. Could you grab it real hard with both hands? He's real silly, y'all. I'm glad he's silly. I see you, Kirby. Could you get it off for me? I'm shooting a video. <laughs> Thank you. All right. We're looking for crispy, crispy, crispy chicken. And remember, <laughs> the chicken is stuffed with <laughs> broccoli and macaroni and cheese. Can you watch the stuff on me one, one second? It's really hard for the chef in here, but I'm making it. You got your back turned towards me. Let me see the place over here. Can I get both for the plate? Both for the plate. And we're gonna be doing plate up with this delicious heat. And I need some serving silverware. Well, that's eating silverware. Some of the serve to get the food out of this. Let's check out our, uh, and move that out of the way. That out of the way. Thank you. Let's check out our chicken wings. Stuffed fried chicken wings with macaroni and cheese. Could you give me a better spoon than that? Thank you. I'm, I'm recording. And just kind of put some, you, you can start putting the, the food on the plate. Thank you. Right, it's kind of hard. And we'll check, just one. I'm gonna let y'all check this out. I'm trying to focus on you guys too. I'm gonna take care of my son. This is your, excuse me. Excuse me, could you put that back please? Rick, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm trying to put that on there. You don't have to do that. I'm sorry. I had him set it up just like I wanted. All right, this guy's got a scream, I'm a single dad. So, I'm doing this plate with stuffed fried, ch with stuffed fried chicken wings with broccoli and macaroni and cheese. I need a potato salad way over here. Oh my God. Y'all gotta pray for me, y'all. This boy putting potato salad twice on the plate. He's killing me. I just need to put it in here. That's where it goes. Just put it in this side, please. Could you put the potato salad in the plate? Potato salad go over here, and potato salad goes there. That's all you gotta do is just put it in, in the plate. Thank you. You're killing me, y'all. Pray for me. Culinary is not for everybody. 
Some people take it way too deep. That's what the slots for. You put the food in the slots. Yeah, you put the food in the slots, man. I know that. Now nah, you put it on the plate. Cause you said put it on some of us and put the. I said put it on there and let me top it off. Put it in here and let me top it off, Rick. All I have to do is top it off, like that. That's all I have to do. That's it, Rick. And guess what? My, 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 I had other stuff going on. Every time. Once you do that, this is what happens. Every time. So I'm gonna bust this open. That's what I'm telling you. Don't have time to play in here. Every time. Every time. I'm gonna show it to you guys in one second. What y'all think? Smash or pass? Give, give me this piece of cornbread. Just one of them. And I can make dressing with it. I just put the brown on the top. But I can't, I can't babysit you and cook too. I can't. I promise you I can't. I tried, Rick. It's kind of hard. Oh, wow. I'm single dad parenting. We ain't trying to cook a meal. Y'all bear with me. Now let's open this up. Where's it going? One second. Can y'all see? One second. I got my cornbread. I'm gonna just set my cornbread right here. Cause I ain't gonna lie to y'all, on my plate, I still want some butter beans. I'm just gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to shove them in there some way, somehow. I want me some butter beans. I'm gonna get me some butter beans. What is, is that all we can cook you? Can I get some macaroni and cheese too? It's in the steal it. Just hold the bottom of it. Thank you. Oh, okay, cool. I just got to taste some macaroni and cheese with the broccoli inside. I'm sorry. Anthony Bridges said, don't be so hard on the young man. I can't, Anthony Bridges. He made me burn my cornbread. No, I got to tell him to stop playing. All my hard work. You really can't play in the kitchen. See, see my cornbread? I can't, I can't cheat you and try to cook at the same time, so I just throw my cornbread away. So I'm not being hard on them, just telling them, hey man, I can't talk to you all day. I'm, I got stuff cooking on a certain type of temperature. And it's making it burn by me having to babysit you. That's why I was talking like that, because this is what happens. But I can still use it to make um, cornbread, and I'm not ashamed. You can't really teach people or do stuff like that if they don't know how to cook in the kitchen. It's going to make you burn up everything they'll be struggling just to dice some tomatoes while everything's burning so let them just bite it so i'm just showing y'all that's why i was talking like that see it, it burnt i wasn't trying to be hard at all i got things i gotta do let's open it up sorry about that it's no big deal i'm a dad when you to it let's check it out mm. oh my god Mm, mm, mm. Oh, snap. Oh, my God. I'm not even worried about the cornbread. I got one piece. It's just two of us. But these are really, really delicious. Oh, my God. DD, can you see this? Hold up, D. DD. Look at how crispy it is. Look at this. So I'm not really tripping on that. I'm in here creating recipes and I'm be kind of serious so y'all don't pay me no attention. This stuff ain't even out yet. Nobody ain't never did this. They have never did this. These are stuffed chicken wings with broccoli and cheese. And you can see the cheese right here inside the fried chicken. 
Rick, can you come get your play out the way? Please. I'm trying to talk to the audience and show them my food as a chef. I already burnt one dish up. Could you please help me? Thank you. And I'll say that because I'm human. I, ca I can't babysit and do things like this too. You see my, my cornbread is burnt. But you can take it and use it like for like dressing. So it's going to be okay. Back to the chicken wing. So y'all don't think I'm acting mean, but in the kitchen, you really, it's hard supervising people in the kitchen. It's one of the hardest things to do. All right, so let's bite it one more time. Oh. Oh my God. Mm, mm, mm. Stuff fried chicken wing. Look at the crust. Y'all see the crust? Mm, mm, mm. Oh my God, Didi said she can see it. Didi, you gotta taste this thing right here, girl. Look at that crust on it. Oh my God, I found a way, new way to eat macaroni and cheese, y'all, and broccoli. I stuffed it inside a chicken wing. That's it. Let's bite it one more time. I wish it was somebody here to bite it. I wish I had a lady so she can bite it, but I don't. So I gotta bite it by myself. It's dripping with sauce. Ooh, I wish I had a lady so y'all can bite this. I'm telling y'all, y'all need to bite this. Oh my God, wow. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Ooh. Mm, mm, mm. And Rick, you can finish uh, fixing your dinner if you want to. It's all ready for you. This is really, really good. The crust on that chicken. The buttermilk crust, I give a thumbs up. Didi said she's getting the menu together right now. Get it together, girl. Get it together. Please get that menu together. I'm finna put this. And that's just the thing when you're in the kitchen, man. You got it's, it's so important to stay focused in the kitchen. I want y'all to learn from that. Because sometimes y'all think the chefs are, are fussing at y'all, man. But he he's handling a lot of things. He might be talking to customers outside. He has a lot of things to do. Besides supervise. And he's trying to get out good food and make creations like this. So y'all get y'all 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 get 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 uh the chef a break. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? To help him out at least. These are some awesome dishes. Oh my god. And you can eat it all the way down to the tip. Okay. Look at the crust on that. Mm mm mm. Now let's check, let's go for the butter beans. Gotta have cornbread inside the butter beans. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my God. Can I see the hot sauce, please? And then Dr. Pepper. Can I see the drink? Oh, we're gonna have to have a drink with this. Oh. Look at that wing. And I'm just waiting on the hot sauce to pour it on, I swear. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Can I see the obey? Y'all ought to follow me on my new YouTube channel. It's really cool. Got a lot of recipes on there from um, the cooking show. The D. Armstrong Show. And a lot of great things. And that's Ham Shank. That's all my butter beans. I'm just gonna crumble up a little bit more cornbread. 
All right. That's enough for me. I'm ready. Let's go in. How many people like butter beans and cornbread? If you do, hold up. I got a delicious bite for you. Here you go. There you go. That's just for you. Uh-oh. Let's get your hand. That's okay. Because you got a stuffed chicken wing right here, girl. That is just out of this world. You guys stay chefy. Enjoy the page. Taste is good. Eat so yummy. Oh, my God. Got to bite it. It's really good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my God. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Stay selfie. Enjoy the pay. I'm out. Mm. Stuff chicken wings, man. Tasty eats.